I'm gonna have to close the windows because it will be too loud otherwise. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, it's been quite a while, but we're back. And I thought I'd come back with just doing my makeup and chatting, basically my everyday makeup, because I haven't done, haven't posted in so long. Um, I did actually have like three videos filmed, but you know when you, not like you know, but like, I just hated the videos and I didn't even want, want to watch it myself, so I don't know why I would post that. But A-levels are over, holidays are over. So I thought, why not just carry on doing what I love to do? I've been doing loads of these on TikTok, but today I thought I'd do one on YouTube. Um, and yeah, catch you up and hopefully you enjoy the video. I'm gonna start my makeup with this Glow Hub Scar Slayer. I always rave about this on TikTok. It's so good. Um, for my acne scarring, and I always just put that on before any skin prep. Um, as you can see, my skin has got so much better, but I don't know if that's literally just to do with the sun. I really hope it's not, because that would just be very unfortunate for me. And then I wait for that to like dry down. And then I use the Glow Recipe. This is the moisturiser. This is like their um, watermelon collection. So I just put it up all over my face, keep me nice moisturised, as I don't want to get any crusty makeup, crusty dusty. I use the Glow Recipe Dew Drops, which are just really nice for like glowy makeup. I also got my nails done yesterday, and I've gone for a long nail, like for the last month maybe I've had a long nail. I always normally go for short acrylics, but I thought maybe I'll just switch it up. And I've used like these baby pink, they're very long. Well, for me anyway, that's not very long for many people, but I love them. I think they're really good, but I have caught them once and I only got them done yesterday, so that's annoying. These are the, um, kind of like the foundation choice, but they're not. They're a um, Radiance Booster, the iconic one. They're not full coverage at all, but to be honest, I'm very lucky with my skin right now. Don't want to speak too soon, but it's quite good. And I just use this Refi brush, which is like a stippling brush. I'm using this Lancome concealer. I found this on TikTok. It's called the All Over Concealer. I don't know how to pronounce the actual proper name, but that's the one I use. And then I normally use the H&B, but today it's not found. So I think this is run out. I don't have a light concealer to use today, which is quite, quite a shame. I'm just going to use this Bella Mienta contour like chubby stick. Literally whack that all over my face by the way. And I just use this with fire brush. And as you can see my skin is very dewy and glowy. Which a problem is actually that I left my powder last, last night in my best friend's bag. Which isn't that much of a problem to me but for my sister because it's her powder she doesn't know. It's, uh, it's going to be a nightmare. It's going to be tears later. When she finds that out and tries to get ready for her night. And I can't actually go and drive to get it because her key, I left my keys in her bag too. Basically, I left the club. Anyway, I'm using these iconic um, multi-use cheek glows. It's like putty, this. It's very cool. Uh, let's put it on my cheeks. But yeah, I left the club and they were also in there. And, I, and her car was parked outside, but I just could not be bothered to go and get all my stuff from the car. So I do need to go and get that. Oh well. I'm using the NYX Control Freak. I use this all the time. And I've been getting my eyebrows tinted, which has just been a lifesaver because I don't know how many like get ready with me's on TikTok I've set, I've done. And my eyebrows, I just always say I hate doing my eyebrows, so I'm not even gonna do them because I just hate doing them when they're tinted. They're lovely. I just love doing them because you can just slick it back. We don't have the powder, guys. I don't know what I'm going to do about that. This is not going to be happy. Also, so random and off topic. I do need to find a powder, though. Bear with. Yes! We do. Fit Me, Matt and Paulus, Classic Ivory. Because I'm planning on going gap year, I had to quit netball because I can't just leave the team like mid-season to go to Australia. I had to quit, which is, well I didn't quit, I just didn't like try retrial, uh, which is just really annoying because I love playing netball, it's so good for me and as much as like <sighs> at times it can be frustrating, I, I just love it. 
I'm just going to use my blusher. This is from Laura Mercier in the shade Strawberry. Plan with uni. That's a whole discussion in itself. So, well, I was going to go, well, I applied because you have to apply at my school. Like, you have to apply even if you know you're not going to go. Um, so, I applied and the only reason I would go is for everyone, and this is so bad to say, but everyone, all my friends said this as well, like the experience, like you meet loads of new friends, like you're so independent and you get a degree, like what is like not good about that? But to be honest, I, there's nothing I really, I'm like, oh my God, I want to learn. Like I want to go to class, class? God, I've been speaking to Freddie too much. I want to go to like my classes, like enjoy it, but I, I know I won't. I don't really like learning. There's nothing I do want to learn about. So I applied, I'm going to reapply next year. And my teachers like are pretty certain that I'd get in with the grades I got to all three, well, to the ones I want to go to anyway. But um, it's just, yeah, like a waiting game. Like I might go to Australia, come home and just like, I probably will go to Australia and love it, but I, I am a home girl. Like I love being with my family and I love staying at home. Like I just love doing that. So I don't think I'll stay out there for more than four months. Um, but I know it will be really good for me and to come out of my like, comfort zone this is the we should read tiktok shop this is so good by the way uh to come up my comfort zone i need to do that so it'd be really good scar i'm using this mac 3d black clash this is very good sitting down here oh because my legs are aching so bad i really want this channel like obviously i've been i haven't been doing it full like i haven't been like trying my best i've literally done it here and then i think i did the most videos in lockdown and then I kind of just like went back to school and it was just busy and stuff but I do want to like carry on doing it just for like my own benefit because I, I love doing it and I love editing videos and stuff I just want to do it for me like it makes me happy and I love like filming and stuff but by no means am I like like even doing this makeup tutorial right now like I know that I'm not a like a amazing makeup art like I just I know people probably wouldn't ever follow this it's just showing you guys what I do. Okay, here's the mascara, done. This mascara is just the best thing in the world. We're gonna go in. This is a Rimmel lip liner called Nude. That's the lip liner. This is what I use. This is the Revolution Super Dewy Liquid Blush. This is what it looks like in the shade Blushing in Love. And I just put that in the center and then I dab it. And that is my makeup complete. This is giving like that aesthetic TikTok like girl. Um, anyway, here's my makeup. Glowy blush. Quite like my hair looks so dark. Um, it's not, I haven't dyed or anything. It's just very outgrown. Perfume of the world on. Baccarat. Stunning. Hopefully you enjoyed watching and I will definitely be back. I'm not just saying that, I like I will be back. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.